Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So that Odin grind is over. I did go for the five star round two. He went for 65.1 million round one. And we'll take a look at the score that I put up. If you know me at all, you know I went for overkill. And some of you may have been on the stream, and so you know what score I put up. All right, so we're going to take a look at the leaderboards. As you can see, I've already started the uh, next grind. I just ran my six stars. As you see, I haven't touched the other arenas. Uh, that's my idea of taking a little bit of a break. I ran my six stars, didn't run my five stars. Tomorrow, we'll see. I might not run my five stars until uh, later on in the day. All right, so let's go on over here. And I can see it right over there, rank 39. So we got the five-star Odin. Uh, we're going to look at that one last. Uh, we skipped the three-star because you always get the three-star as long as you do the milestones of any of the featured arenas. And I do the milestones of every featured arena. So I always get the three-star. Four-star, I got round one. Uh, and, of course, Magneto I already had. All right. Let's start in the uh, four-star basic, which is Magneto. And we will just take a look, see if we recognize any names. Now, uh, I know some people were asking, is the four-star Magneto worth it? Yes, he is. Uh, four-star Magneto can rip apart metal champions uh, better than some five-stars. Obviously, if you have you know the higher rarity, that's the one you want to go with. But if you don't, he is definitely a good um, champion to go for, uh, especially if you're under, um, if you're not even uncollected yet. This would have been a very, very good champion to pick up. All right. And I don't really expect to see any names that I recognize, to be honest with you. Uh, he is an old champion, but he just recently got a rework. And now he is awesome. He went from someone that people questioned. Uh, when My five star, uh, I used a gem on my five star and took him to rank uh, four. And people, you know, were looking at me like I was crazy. And they were like, why would you do that? Well, he had some synergies that I was using a lot. Uh, crit synergies with other mutants, Wolverine and uh, Storm and all of that. And so I wanted to, you know, take him up in case I needed to use him. But then they reworked him. And I took mine to five. And then I got the six star. And the six star I've taken to rank two. Six star is not awakened. But he doesn't really need to be awakened. But that does add a little bit of survivability to him. Uh, makes him a little tougher. Other than that, you know, the damage, the domination over champions that are metal, all of that does not need him to be awakened. All right, getting down to the end here. This arena, we only get to see the top 200 of all the arenas. This one is percentage-based, so thousands of people got this champion uh, that we did not see. All right, next up, we're going to check out the four-star. Now, in this one, I know some people may have gone for the four-star second round who went for the five-star first round just to collect. Uh, and like me, uh, you know, I just collected him. But I do plan on taking him up when there's an objective that I can, you know, get those units by uh, taking him up, you know, cosmic advancement, so to speak. Uh, Coat Hanger, congratulations on that grind. You go ahead. Um, but we are also looking forward to a rework, not a rework, but a buff of this champion. Fuzz, congratulations. You know, if you don't know what happened, he has a pre-fight ability that people drooled over. But it was quite broken, and it would have broken the game. They uh, got notified of this. They looked at it, and they said, yes, 
that would break the game. Let's, uh, n you know, um, nerf him pretty much. And he was not in the arenas yet. But people did get the early access bundles. So they don't really like doing that. Believe me, you know, uh, the integral. Congratulations. Um, but yeah, they, they are reluctant to do that. But when they do, it's because of something that they consider serious. Um, so uh, I don't think they did a refund or anything like that, but they did um, do a couple of things. One, they promised that he would get a buff. Um, so he's going to get who knows uh, how much better than he currently is, because right now, the main reason people wanted him was that pre-fight ability. You know, as a champion himself, not so good. But they have committed to reworking him. They're also giving those who got the early access bundles. Basically, the next champion, they'll get Cavalier Crystals. And I don't know if those Cavalier Crystals that they're going to get have the new drop rates. But the Cavalier Crystals have gotten increased drop rates. So the next champion, they may not want that champion, but it's better than getting nothing. Uh, Big Sexy, what it do? Congratulations on that four star. So, you know, not a perfect, um, you know, solution, but better than nothing. Gray Wolf, congratulations. So, you know, that aside... We are really hoping for a better, um, you know, champion after this. The Glory of Man, congratulations. Don't usually see your name here. All right. There we go. So that is the top 200 for the four-star. The top 800 get the champion. We only see 200, so 600 people... Um, got the champion that we didn't see. If you are one of those, let us know what score you put up, what rank you got. All right. And now for the main event. And I expect to see some names. I know Legacy put up, um, I think he said 73 million or so. So I'm expecting to see his name here. So let's go on in. And Black Gamer right off. Congratulations. All right, number three. Woo, go ahead. All right, let's see who else went for this guy. I don't know of anyone that got him ranked one, uh, for round one who uh, was going for the dupe. He doesn't really need to be duped. Enzo, congratulations, my friend. Rank 24. Nice. Okay, okay. See uh who else, man? Dark side, congratulations. Putting in that grind. And there's that Lord Shadow fellow. Hey. And as you can see, I put up 80 million. So that means all of them that you just saw put up more than I did. You say I'm crazy, they're crazier. All right. Let's keep going. See if we recognize any other names. Because uh, I know a lot of uh, folks waited like I did for round two. Wanted to see what he went for. 65.1. That was enough. XLR8. Congratulations, man. That's what's up. And we, like I said, we mostly uh, want this guy for his pre-fight. But we're also hoping that he'll turn out to be a, a a decent champion when they get done with him. But he may not. But that pre-fight, yeah. Pharaoh, what's up? Congratulations. Let my people go. All right. Um, let's see. Still looking for your name. Legacy. Man, so many people put up some big boy scores, it looks like. 
Okay. We'll see the top 200, though. There he is. 122. Wow. So 73 million got 122. I put up 7 million more. And look at how many uh, ranks above. That's that's something else, man. But congratulations, Legacy. Uh, I don't want to see you throwing no more snowballs, so I'm happy to see that, man. All right. Let's see who else. And we saw so many people that uh, uh, I know round one get this guy. And his awakened ability, um, I, I don't remember exactly what it does, but I do remember discussions on it. He doesn't need to be awakened. Um, and that Odin sleep, I don't know. Why? Why? Uh, Mir Yir. I don't know if that's uh, Meyer, Meyer, Meyer. I don't know. I've never said your name, but congratulations, fellow dork. Grinding it out, man. Coop, congratulations. Nice, nice. Okay. A lot of people followed uh, me and waited for round two. See what he went for. And I don't know what he went for uh, round two yet. Send me all. Congratulations, man. Haven't seen you around in a while. Hope you're doing well. All right. Let's see. Getting down to the wire here. No, 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 no. Don't see anyone else. And that is it. So um, the top 300 get this champion. So 100 people got the champion that we don't see. If you're one of those, leave a comment. Um, definitely leave a comment. It's good for even historic purposes. And I can give you a shout out and a congratulations if you picked up the champion. All right, so that's gonna do it for the video, guys. Uh, I am going to finish up Act 6.2. Got one path left. And there's a level up event going on. So hopefully there's gonna be a nice opening tomorrow i'll have two six stars to open up one i bought uh the dual class which is the first time we've seen a dual class six star crystal uh for 3k units and i'll be able to open up another six star after i finish uh exploring 6.2 all right so take care uh hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and leave a comment both of those things help me out tremendously and you all have a Blessed day.